The ANSAT 2RC armed reconnaissance helicopter was developed by Kazan Helicopters. It is based on ANSAT light utility helicopter. The Kazan Helicopter Manufacturing Company is one of the largest helicopter manufacturers in the world. It is also producing Mi-8, Mi-17 and Mi-24 helicopters. Previously this plant was producing Mi-1 and Mi-4 helicopters. In total it produced over 12,000 helicopters. These are in service with Russia and have been exported to around 100 countries. So Kazan Helicopters has significant experience in developing and manufacturing helicopter. Mock-up of this helicopter was first revealed in 2005. A demonstrator was first revealed in 2007. However future of this helicopter is uncertain. Currently Russian MOD has no plans to order this reconnaissance helicopter. Also it received no export orders. The Kazan ANSAT 2RC can be used for scouting, perform recon missions, support field artillery by designating target coordinates. Also it can independently support ground forces with its firepower. In concept it is similar to the American OH-58D Kiowa Warrior armed reconnaissance helicopter. Previously there were no specialized helicopter for this role in Russia. This helicopter has a conventional gunship layout. The pilot seated in the rear and gunner at the front. The helicopter is fitted with nose-mounted optical and infrared sensors. These sensors can operate in day-slash-night and adverse weather conditions with limited vision. This reconnaissance helicopter is armed with a 12.7mm machine gun. Also there are four hardpoints on wing stubs. These can carry various weapons, such as unguided rockets, anti-tank missiles, bombs, or air-to-air -air missiles. Weapon load can be tailored to suit mission requirements. The ANSAT 2RC is powered by two Canadian Pratt & Whitney PW207K turboshaft engines, developing 630 shop each. It has a four-blade main rotor. There is a small door with observation window at the rear of the fuselage. It gives access to avionics compartment. However it seems that in case of emergency this helicopter has a capability to carry one or two passengers during a combat rescue. The Russian Mi-28 attack helicopter also has got this capability.